Hi, this is Dr. Nishal, and in this video we're going to be talking about increasing CD4 cell count in patients with HIV. Uh, now, HIV is a condition in which the immune system is pretty much, uh, in simple terms, <laughs> obliterated, so we definitely want to rebuild it. Uh, and the first thing I would always recommend is increasing CD4 cells, uh, CD4 cell count. That's because we see that this is uh, dramatically uh, reduced in patients with HIV and full-blown AIDS. Uh, so uh, what can do this? What has been clinically proven to do this? Uh, the first one would be neem. And neem is actually an Ayurvedic medicine. It's mainly used for skin disorders, but it's been clinically proven to increase CD4 cell count in patients with HIV. So it's definitely one of the things you want to supplement. I recommend you doing this under the supervision um, of an Ayurvedic doctor who has been trained in both using neem as well as treating HIV. Uh, patients. Uh, the second one is known as Ganoderma lucidum. This is also a medicinal herb uh, that does the same, increases CD4 cell count. It also increases CD3 cell count. And the uh, the third option would be colostrum uh, that increases CD4 cell count as well as CD8. So these three things uh, support the formation of CD cells. Um, and uh, it's relatively safe to use. Um, there's one side effect with um, neem that should be noted in that it would be, um, well, for the case of HIV patients, this is usually some a topic that's quite um, sensitive in any case. Uh, neem, there's been a few clinical studies that show that it actually can reduce fertility, uh, but this is usually a temporary thing that can be reversed afterwards. Uh, so, yeah, these, these are three relatively safe things to use. Um, no adverse effects, um, a dramatic, uh, impactful um, adverse effects that uh, I am familiar with or that I have come across. I've used it in hundreds of patients, uh, especially neem. Uh, and it's a very safe thing to use. However, there are a few people out there who can be allergic to neem when applied topically. So that's why I recommend doing it at the supervision of the doctor always. So yeah, this was my take on uh, increasing CD4 cell count in HIV patients. Uh, in the next video, I'll be talking about increasing T cells. So I'll see you. I'll see you there. In the meantime, if you'd like to get in touch with me, you can do so through my website, drnichal.com, and I do online consults for patients all over the world. And I'll see you soon.